Yeah, yeah, what it do, what it do, man. Young Dre and this motherfucker. Playing this. Clean ass Assassin's Creed for the five, you dig? Just chilling and shit right now, you know what I'm saying? Just started this shit, man. Let's get to it. Alright, go on. See what this fragment shit is, real quick. Fuck, she can't climb up for it, eh? What the fuck? for Hemming come with much grief. How the fuck do I get up on here, bud?
What the fuck, but Shit on the inside? What the fuck, dude? That shit nowhere to be seen, bruh. Some fucking garbage. Greek super fragment. It's a lot of fuck. Is it not letting me get it? Just had it pinged, dude. What the fuck, man? I need your up. Just I don't understand this shit at all. It's another Ubisoft fucking bullshit. They fucking pull. Getting tired of fucking games that you be saw me playing this shit, man. Can't stand that fucking garbage. You know how many times this shit's happened since I've been playing this game, but fucking garbage. And too soon. Fires, fights, and every man soaked in meat. Ugh, this has gone too far. Hemthorpe could burn before the pyres lit. Gods, have I failed, my dear Jarl? Peace, Trickley. I'll do what I can to calm things. Ha, 
Too late for your your boda, as you say. Ah, balls. I dragged it all the way from Rus. It is back to water ale for me, I suppose. If you drink enough, ale is a fine fix to any problem. Very true, very yeah, true. Right. Join me if it's you call marijuana, bro. A bit of drink in the belly never hurts. Stay sharp. Fuck, man. Shit I'm talking about, dog. Dumb man, tell us that that shit is fucking right here. Thor, you've saved my life. When you sober up, steer clear of roosters. He's a dead man if I ever get my hands on him. I 
will find much honor following you. Raid with me, warrior, for plunder, glory, and Valhalla. Come out, you dung-eating rat! What madness is this? You dare wash our beloved Hemingir with your filth! I asked you a question, friend. There's a Saxon within. One stupid enough to try sending Hemingir to heaven over Valhalla. Now he cowers behind a locked door! I only did right by his immortal soul! You will get what is right for you! Calm yourselves, all of you. I'll speak with him, unmask his true intentions. Get that stain out here now! People are quite upset. Leave me be! I did nothing wrong! You should walk out of here, on your own, before you cannot walk at all. Yes, yes, I'll walk, I'll walk. Don't hurt me, please! There's a key there. If you open the door, I... I will follow you out. <laughs> Enough. Let him speak to explain himself. I loved Heminger. I swear. I only want him to fly free in the kingdom of God. So you drench his body with your filth waters? Is it your Christian holy water? Of course. <laughs> I anointed him in the name of the Lord. Filth water. I be saying the same shit, but you need me going to seeing them Catholic churches and everybody be dipping their hands in the holy water, it's like communal holy water, I always be thinking like, damn, how dirty is that water? If it's just sitting there all day, and then you got a hell of people touching that shit with their hands, you know what I'm saying? And then they wipe that shit on their faces too, and the sign of the cross. Shut your mouths, both of you. Your antics have outlasted their welcome. Now go. The order seems to have been restored. Now to treat me, to let him know. I bet you they think, well, it's holy water, so bacteria won't grow in it. <laughs> I have calmed the guests as it's much like as all they that. in their grief. They mourn. Crazy motherfuckers who didn't get the vaccine Still, and you. COVID, and they're How like, you God will save me. God won't let me get the COVID. When they're in them churches, fucking, you know, hell of motherfuckers in there and shit. God's gonna save us. And you heard a whole church is just coming down with COVID, and only the frail, and you know what I'm saying? Fucking people on the lower end, the socioeconomic scale, those are the ones who get hurt the quickest. And usually it's black and brown people. Even though I don't get that fucking saying because fucking black people are brown, you know what I'm saying? I've seen some, uh, Mexicans darker than the uh, cousins that I have, you know what I'm saying? Show me. And like, because 
Indian, they consider themselves brown people and shit. And I definitely see a lot of Indians that are darker than most of the people in my family, you know what I'm saying? Like they consider us black, but the Indians are considered brown. I don't understand that shit either, but... So there we But, you know, don't get it wrong, I have, I do got people in my family that are, like, real dark, like my Uncle Steve and shit. He's like... Hell, dark. He's handsome and shit, and he got that. It's like just beautiful ass dark skin. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah anyway, and a lot of people who say God won't let me die. COVID, or, you know, God will save me from COVID. They got sick and died, you know what I'm saying? Just shit like that, it pisses me off. It's like, man, dude. Just fucking take the advice that a fucking professional is telling you what to do. And of course, I understand black people have, you know what I'm saying, hard time to trust the medical community in America because a lot of shit they did back in the day, like, Tuskegee Airmen shooting them motherfuckers up with syphilis, telling them his vitamins and shit. Then you got all of the doctors around the country, really, that were trying to sterilize black women, Mexican women too, and shit. You know what I'm saying? Sterilizing them without telling them and shit. It's crazy shit, you know what I'm saying? So I understand that untrust in the black community when it comes to doctors and shit, you know, so I guess the listening to them part I guess it was kinda hard because of, what the fuck, man? Why does she keep disappearing, bruh? Garbage. Yeah. That's the cold part about it, you know, they, they don't trust the fucking medical community telling them what to do, you know what I'm saying? So they go on their own shit, thinking they really know what to do, but they fuck around and do that shit and then get sick, catch COVID and then die, you know, in Chicago and a lot of black communities. Yeah. That shit swept through those communities so fast, bruh. It was kind of like a fucking massacre. All oh, from this little virus and shit. But that's what it is. People on a lower scale, because they gotta work and shit. They can't stay home, you know what I'm saying? They can wait that shit out, because they got kids, you know what I'm saying? They gotta do all that shit. So those are the ones who are on the front line. Even though that's the most dangerous place. You know what I'm saying? It's always a place where the people on the lower scale. Or lower part of the socioeconomic scale stand. So this shit sucks, man. Anyway, young Dre and this motherfucker be right back. Go on.